What's going on guys? We are back with another cruise vlog. My name is Vanessa and this is Vacation Vibes. Today we're on board the Freedom of the Seas with Royal Caribbean. I'm so excited to show you my first real Royal Caribbean cruise. Oh, and I have a guest. Come on, guest. I have a guest. Ah, Hi. It's our Crowdasia. out of Instagram. <laughs> hey, Instagram. <laughs> Miami at the cruise port ready to go welcome back to vacation vibes your favorite deal is back and we're ready to cruise so come join us hey guys we're back for another ride another on one. another cruise with your girl so you know we're about to have so much fun first things first let's grab a drink and let's go check out the ship we grabbed a goombe smash and a margarita to enjoy our very first drink on board. Guys, the goombe smash is where it's at. The top deck of this ship is so colorful and so pretty. There's so much to look at, so much to do, and we're going to show it all to you. But first, let's hit the wind jammer. So I feel like their food so far is already better than Carnival. I love Carnival and their food is okay, but I feel like we're cruising got them on the food. Like no 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 competition. So yeah. Okay, we've made it to the Windjammer to eat. The food is amazing, as Deja said before. Um, I just went ahead and got a couple of sandwiches. I got a uh, mozzarella and buffalo sandwich. Try something new. And then I got like a ham and cheese sandwich. These lovely potatoes and a scissor salad on the side. So we're gonna grub it up, dub, get this in. I'll let you know how the food tastes. It looks good. So far, it's good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no complaints over here. But anyhow, so we just finished eating the one jammer. Um, the food is definitely better than what we're used to on Carnival as far as the buffet goes. We're gonna reserve on the rest of our reviews for the rest of the restaurants. We're gonna give them everything a fair shot. No buffet to buffet, main dining room to main dining room, especially restaurant, especially restaurant. And we'll see who comes out on top. Who do you think is gonna win? Who? For the, the best food on board. Oh. I would say the Mardi Gras had really good restaurants like yeah. that, that were free, that were included. Yeah, the Mardi so, Gras. But as far as like the buffet, all, I think World Ruben got the buffet. Yeah, the, the Chi Bang was real good on uh, Mardi Gras, and I can't wait to have that again. But um, so far, so good. Um, I think we're going to head to the Sellaway. It looks like Celebrity Cruise is just trying to make their escape out of the port right now. Deja would like another drink. I'm not opposed to another drink. You need to go to the helicopter pad? Yeah, it is. Well, it's so fun, the helicopter pad. That is, if you've never been on the helipad on Royal Caribbean, um, I'm going to show you how to get there. Um, it's a great, quiet place. I think it's a really nice place to do sail away too, because you get to be in the front of the ship. And um, it's really cool. It's quite windy when the ship is moving, but it's really cool. Here we go. Celebrity way over there trying to do the little turnaround to get out. They've been turning around for like 30 minutes. <laughs> okay, guys, so an update from the last cruise you don't have to wear masks on board, it's optional. So, feeling free, I can, I can breathe as I'm running around indoor and outdoor. So, that's nice. Um, let's catch an elevator, see if we can find it. I'm gonna say deck three. This is the Royal Promenade. This is the center of the ship where all of the action takes place. You can find things here like your shops, your coffee shops, ice cream, pizza, whatever it is that you like, it's probably in the Royal Promenade. Um, all right guys, welcome to the Grand Promenade. This part I do really like about Royal. They make their uh, the promenade really big. Rumor has it, they're bringing back the promenade uh, parties where they do the balloon drop up in here. Now last time I was on Royal, I had a promenade uh, room at these rooms here. So I had a view to the promenade and I could check out the parties from my room. It does get a little loud. So if you want a promenade room, 
take that into consideration. This is uh, Sorrento's, the police, the pizza spot. That's open all night long. And we're heading forward on the ship. And we're gonna see if we can try to find the door to the, uh, the helipad. All right guys, so Starlight Lounge. There's a door on the far right side. Go outside the door, keep walking forward. You see behind me, there's some steps right here, and that'll take you straight up to the helipad. Deck five, Starlight Lounge, door to the right, up to the helipad. You're welcome. The helicopter pad is a great spot for maximum views from the front of the ship, and to do that cute little Titanic pose. Now let's head back upstairs to the top deck and show you what else this ship has to offer. You've got pools, plenty of pools. You've got your bars. You've got some water features. Let's go check it out. We've got your basketball court, your rock climbing, and we have some sweet water slides. Let's not forget to mention the flow rider. And guys, stay tuned throughout this vlog series because I'll be trying all of these things out for you. But in the meantime, let's head over to Selaway. Next up, check out our new digs with this room tour. All right guys, let's start from the beginning. So as you enter the room, right to the left, you have the bathroom. What I like already about Royal Caribbean is they have the hard um, shower. I don't even know, oh, here we go. We got oh, two openings here. There you go. And um, let's check it out for size. Um, I am five eight and a half. Plenty of room for me, you know. Bathrooms are always gonna be a little cramped on a on a cruise anyway. Then you have this cool rounded uh, sink here. You've got a few mirrors to choose from, so you can get all all of the angles that you need. We don't have much storage. Oh wait. Oh. Shut me up. We got storage. Okay. We have closets. Pretty good size closet as well. We have um, some shelves over here. Got the good old shelving. And then um, plenty of hangers. That's good. Life vests are inside the cabin. And then I guess if you need some more racks, you have some racks. So then over here we have the desk. We got a nice chair. A nice little leather chair plenty of oh, oh, there we go plenty of storage here to put our things which is nice I love storage I love dressers yeah. what okay <laughs> got some lights that are on our vanity so you make sure the makeup looking nice but we also have the full size mirror over here so you can check out that outfit unobstructed view we love unobstructed views in the mirror hello and then moving over to the bed tv on a swivel so you can watch it from the couch Ooh. watch from the couch or the bed that's nice our bed is currently in the, the king size but we're gonna get it split um nice rounded edges here so it's easy to um get out of it and moving on to our balcony i love this part of our room so yes, the balcony is the best part. It's super spacious. You got plenty of room. Um, we have two chairs and a table, which is super nice. So if we want to have you know our morning mimosas out here, or we want to you know have breakfast in a room, we have a place to put it. And I mean the view, always breathtaking. Bless you. Um, we have a couch, like nice and uh, velvety. Gotta say, I like this couch. Um, I can tell this is definitely upgraded. As a matter of fact, I can tell the entire cabin has gone through 
renovations. The carpet looks new. The uh, couch is a little different fabric than they used to have on Royal. The backsplash behind the bed is super cool. Um, some of the artwork, it's just refreshed. The color scheme, it's really fresh. Um, I, I like it, I really like it. All right, so we're back in the room. Um, Sail Away was uh, cool as usual. It's always fun to watch your ship leave and head out to sea. Uh, now we're back in the room. We're about to get ready for dinner tonight. We got chops. Um, so I'm gonna make you go ahead and wait for the next video to see dinner time. Um, you could be in the frame, girl. Come in the conversation. You, you know, look at crazy. And I'm different. <laughs> you know? <laughs> anyway guys, if you enjoyed this first video of our emb embarkation aboard the Freedom of the Seas, guys stay tuned because we're about to get into the fun stuff. We got chops go coming up tonight. We're gonna go party a little bit tonight so you can see what the party atmosphere is like. And I can say right now, it seems like we have a really cool group on the ship. Everybody seems to be really down to earth and chill and super friendly. So I'm looking forward to the nightlife. Um, so if you like this video, be sure to like this video, um, subscribe to the channel. Guys, I'm trying to get this channel to 10,000 subscribers and I need your help. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button and share this video with a friend. Let's get the Vibe Squad on up there. Let's go, let's go, let's go. That's it for this video. My name is Vanessa, this has been Vacation Vibes and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys. Next time on Vacation Vibes, we review Chops Grill. See you Sunday.